Kyle, we turn to campaign 2012 with the election less than two weeks away. The races are really heating up. Tonight, our news partners of the Providence Journal are separating political fact from fiction in the first congressional district. Democratic incumbent David Cicilline is squaring off against Republican challenger Brendan Doherty. Eyewitness News reporter Andrew Adamson is in the newsroom now with the details. Campaign season is really starting to heat up and the PolitiFact team is back to help you see through the spin. They're rating statements made by candidates from true to false all the way down to pants on fire. We begin with this quote from Brennan Doherty, the Republican first congressional district challenger. In an interview question about his Democratic opponent, David Cicilline, Doherty said Congressman Cicilline, when he was the mayor of Providence, espoused a sanctuary city. So some cities in this country, San Francisco and New Haven, have taken action to become uh, sanctuary sanctuary cities. Providence never did, and in fact, Mayor Cicilline argued against those actions. Uh, Mr. Doherty never offered any evidence that Cicilline said this, so we found this false. Our second statement of the week comes from Doherty's counterpart, David Cicilline. In a debate seen right here on WPRI on October 16, Cicilline said there are more oil rigs in operation in the United States than the rest of the world combined. Mr. Cicilline was relying on a study that found that there were 1,800 oil rigs in the U.S., 1,600 in the rest of the world. Unfortunately, that study did not count uh, Russia and China, which have thousands of oil rigs. So uh, that was just plain wrong. We found this false. You can check out the complete list of PolitiFact statements and ratings on ProvidenceJournal.com. That link is on our website, WPRI.com. In the newsroom, Andrew Adamson, Eyewitness News.